Hi, thank you for viewing our Hobby Print How To video. Today we're going to show you a little bit more about the controls in the computer for using a printer. We've just set up a TS705 printer, a Canon, and we're going to go to our control panel on our computer so that we can access the printer maintenance, setup properties, etc. Um, you'll be able to print test sheets and we'll show you how to set up paper settings. So first of all, we're going to go to our computer control panel. And if you see right down here on the left hand side at the bottom of the screen, we've got our Windows icon. If we click on there, on the cogwheel there, we're going to use the settings tab. Now you'll see that it's brought up all these devices and we're going to choose the printers from the devices here. If you go across to the right hand side of the screen, you'll see that you've got devices and printers at the top. Click on there and it brings up all the devices that we have on our computer. Now we've got the TS705 here and it's loaded as our default. So what we're going to do is right click on that and we're going to go to printer properties. Now here you can see that you have got all these different tabs on the top for different things. You can play with those to your heart's content at a later date. But we just want to show you the very basics of this. So on the general tab you have printer test page. If you click on that it will send a test page to your printer and you'll be able to check that out, make sure everything's working correctly, that all the colours are fine, you check that you've got your paper in correctly and just print. We're going to cancel because we're not actually going to print it today. What you can also see on here is that you have got the preferences tab. Now you can access this here or you can do it directly from again right click on the icon and printer preferences. It's exactly the same tab. Now if you're going to be using this for photo printing and particularly in our case we're going to look at edible printing you can sell, set this up as default so you don't have to go through it every time. So we'll show you quickly how to do that by going on to photo printing. It's collected borderless here you can change that if you want but we'll leave it on there. Preview before printing just so that you can see what you're printing before you send it to print and we're going to set our paper type at matte paper to give us a good finish. The print quality we're going to set as high again if we're printing photographics we want a good quality. The paper size we will set as A4 and we're going to select it from the rear tray. If you're using icing sheets, then always use the rear tray. So from here, we can actually save that as a new setting and we're going to simply call this icing sheets. Click OK. And you can see now here, in your general settings, you've got standard photo printing, business document, etc, etc, and icing sheets. So in future, when you go to print, if you click on icing sheets, all the settings are already there for you. And it's as simple as that. You can see that we've got plenty of other tabs across the top where we can change different things. You can play with these if you wish, but we're not going to go through them all today. The only other one we're going to show you is the maintenance tab. This is important if you ever need to do a head clean or check alignments etc. So we've clicked on the tab and you can see here you've got cleaning, deep cleaning, print head alignment, nozzle check. Wouldn't worry about the ones at the other side at the moment but if you've got, if you haven't used your printer for a while and you've got lines in the print then you would click on the cleaning just to give it a quick clean through. The deep cleaning, if it's a little bit more severe and it's not cleaning, you can try that. 
the printhead alignment is used if you've got fuzzy lines etc it's just to go through that to sharpen it up the nozzle check just to make sure that all your print heads are clear and that all the colors are printing if you have a play with them you'll soon familiarize with them and you will be absolutely fine I'm going to click that off so when you go to print in future because you've already created these sheets it's going to make life much easier for you and I hope it's helpful thank you